Well, you can help Poland police find the person who's been robbing homes and cars. We're reporting on this for a second straight day because of how often it's happened. The neighborhoods are just minutes from the police department, too. 27 First News reporter Molly Reed talked to the police chief and a victim who can't believe this happened to him. She's live in the newsroom. That's right, Dave and Erica. The chief of police told me these robbers are getting smarter and braver. Yesterday, we gave you a look at what the suspect looks like that the police are looking for. We'll go ahead and give you another look right now. The picture is of someone that looks like they're wearing a black jacket and hood. In the meantime, the police want to make sure you're taking precautions against these slick burglars. They opened his door and went through his car, and then they got the genie and went in and went in my car over here and in the garage. Rick Devanzo has lived in his home on Brookstone Place for eight years. Two nights ago, someone broke into his car and his son's vehicle. The light was on in the inside of my car, and the console and everything was thrown all over the seats. All of the credit cards, driver's licenses, and valuables in the car were stolen. They're among several people hit up by a recent string of robberies. He said he's never seen something like this happen in his neighborhood. Everybody, you know, lights up their houses at night. It's just unfortunate that it happened and been happening. The police say these robbers are getting pretty smart. They'll go into your car that's parked outside grab your garage door opener and use it to get into your garage to get even more of your belongings. People are leaving those the house doors open from the garage and we've even had a few where they've entered the house and and taken some stuff from inside too. So Chief Gooden says make sure all of your doors are locked to your cars and house at night and when you leave. He says if you are ever suspicious, give them a call but never try to confront a burglar yourself. Just keep them in your visuals. That's it's how usually we get it. It's somebody who just, you know, luck pays attention, sees it, calls us, and, you know, we end up catching them. So. Now, Poland Township Police have been in contact with nearby businesses and neighborhoods who do have security cameras, and they're studying that footage to see if there's any connection between cars or people leading to these robberies. Now, they also are offering an award for anybody who has information and leads to an arrest. You can find information on that and more safety tips on our website, WKBN.com. For now, in the newsroom, Molly Reed, WKBN 27 First News.